Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another unboxing video. Uh, yeah, so yeah, I finally got my hands on some Synchro Storm Legendary Duelists. My first box of this stuff, which I don't know how this slipped under the radar of my card sniffing nose. Alongside Burst of Destiny. How did that even happen? And also, how have supplies locally been so hard to get? Oh my goodness. Also, we are using my uh, Dimension of Chaos sneak peek mat with the Scarlet Red Dragon Archfiend, which looks very nice. It's got the old pendulum zones on the side. Very nice nod to Master Rule Free. And I thought it would be appropriate because there's like Speedroid stuff in here, which is very synchro based. So I think without any further ado, let's crack into this box and get on with it. The fresh box. They've been opened as usual. Ah. Uh, okay, that that pack, that last pack there was a little bit on the folded side. All right, so let's get cracking. This is a set I've been very excited for on a personal note because I do want to build a lot of these win-based decks, and Speedroids is one that I have had in the works for ages. So let's have a look at what we got here. We got Z Own. Oh, okay, a bit of a recycling card. Noble Knight Joan, Defleur, Rush Warrior, Speedroid Duplicate. Okay, not too bad to start off with. And I think we'll just uh, keep cracking on. Try and get through this as fast as possible so that we use this. Well, get this over and done with. Turquoise Warbler Lyristic, Zion, Temptomborg. Ooh, Clear Wing Rider. I got the motorcycle card. Nice. Flow Synchron. Okay. So, so far this looks like the best pull so far. But we're only two packs in, so let's wait until we pull something even better looking before we jump to any conclusions thus far. Alright. Car Turbo. Recovery. Defleur. Tornado Dragon. Ooh. Barrel Canary. That's not too bad. Luristics is another one that I have been wanting to build as well, but at the time they didn't have a lot of support. I think they had like a fusion monster, a uh, one or two Xyz, and about three the four main deck monsters and nothing else. It's kind of like how what Wind Witch was when they first released. They were like a fusion, a synchro. And three main deck monsters. Yeah. Alright, so continuing on. We've got Terratop. Ooh, Stardust Warrior. Rectical Starling. Ooh, Grill Pen of Goldos. And Phantom Feathers. Not too bad. Alright, Red Eye Die, Necrofloor, Stardust Warrior, Ooh, White Steed of the Floral Knights, interesting. Assembled Nightmare, I think that might be one that already did exist, so that might be a rarity bump. I can't remember exactly, but it is nice to see Lyricics get a lot more support. I probably am not going to be uh, going to be seeing any... Uh, Anyone else other than me attempting to play the deck? I know um, one said person did attempt to build a uh, bird deck, but I haven't really seen that in all ages. Another Defleur, Corbett Sparrow, Liberty at Last. Oh, this is definitely a new one. Ensemble Robin and Kite Drake. Okay. Two really nice pulls there. I'm liking it, I'm liking it. Uh, nothing too outstanding there. Pretty much mostly reprints and duplicates. We can pretty much skip that one over. Uh, the Duke Turbo Cobalt. Cobalt's always nice. And 
Chefflet de Fleur. I might be butchering the uh, French sounding name a little bit, but oh well. I'm trying. Yeah, da, 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 da. Ooh, Speedroid Wheel. That's a new one. And Synchro Dilemma. Hmm. Interesting. Two interesting cards. Like, I'm definitely going to get plenty that I can use in decks out of this, regardless. This is very much worth my investment. And uh, let's see what we got next. Blah, blah, blah. Blow Synchron. That's nice. Not epic, but nice. Chambara. Ooh, Totem Bird. Totem Bird's nice. I could always use more Totem Birds. I don't have that many. What else we got? Ah, uh, nothing of note. It almost feels like uh, I'm opening, I'm opening up like like my third box, third or tenth box, and I'm getting nothing but dupes right now. Marble machine, that's nice. Pennant of revolution, okay. That's also nice. Like, we're just flying through these packs because. We're, we're seeing not really, a, not a lot of interesting things. Ooh. Soge de Fleur. And another Phantom Feathers. Okay. Just as we start saying that, we uh, find something a little bit interesting. Now, I am yet to pull that new Le Fleur monster. Ooh, there's one of the uh, two Dracos, the wind one. Fleurit de Fleur. Hmm. And Chevalier de Fleur again. We've got a two we've gotten two of that de Fleur synchro monster so far. But we haven't seen the Baron yet. I'm pretty sure the Baron is in this set. I think. Unless the Baron's in Burst of Destiny. I can't remember. And pretty me mediocre pack there. Like reprints are nice. And that'll help update my uh well, my Speedroid decks. Well, Speedroid deck. And uh, nothing really here. <laughs> this is the own card. That'll. I think that'll definitely see some use in my decks as a uh, field slash continuous spell recycling card. But it will depend on whether or not the deck can reliably trigger it and such. Um, our second Barrel Canary. That's nice. And we're already through one half of the box already. But I'm pretty pleased with the pull so far. Now I wonder, can we get the cover the cover card, the clear wing synchro speedroid synchro monster? I'm hoping yes. We do have a history on our on our channel of actually pulling the cover card. And pulling the cover card would be very epic. We haven't done it yet. We've gotten close, but we haven't hit the nail on the head. Alright. Ooh. Okay. Uh, we saw a sinker on the back there, but we've got Ultra Hound here. Very nice. And... Another Kite Drake. Okay, that's not too bad. We'll take that. That's our second Kite Drake and our first Ultra Hound. Alright, what else we got? Sampled Nightmare. Alright. Fleur. That's our third copy, so we now have a place out of that De Fleur Synchro. Oh, 
Okay, Luristic Bird Call, that's pretty nice. And Totem Bird, I'm liking it. Like, I think so far for our pull of the box, it has to be between that Luristic Xyz Monster and our Speedroid Motorcycle Synchro Monster. Unless we pulled a cover card, which we still have a good chance to do so. We've still got plenty of packs. Not a synchro, synchro Dilemma. Which, this is not exclusive to uh, the Defleur archetype. You can use this of any Synchron monster, like Junk Synchron. Hmm? Hmm? So you could use that in a generic Synchro deck, slash Yusei Synchro deck. Eh, more pretty generic stuff there. Now, something that I do have uh, put aside, I do have a very special unboxing video that I would like to try to get out before the end of the year. It's uh, to give it a uh, bit of a clue slash spoiler, it's not a Yu-Gi-Oh unboxing. It's a different card game. But I just happened to get a box of this mystery card game, which will be re revealed when the video comes out. And when I shoot the video, obviously. And I would also like to get a few other videos out as well while I'm at it. In terms of some vlogs and such. But we'll see how we go. Okay, we got Clearwing Synchro and Defleur. Okay. So that's a step in the right direction, but it's not the nail on the head yet again. But still, I'm going to be very happy with the pulls of this box, because I'm already happy with them. Like, I think we've pulled... We've definitely pulled at least two totem birds, maybe three. Not a kite drake. I think that might be a place that have kite drake now. And yeah, we are just flying shooters. Alright, we got a Celestine Wagtail. Very nice. And another totem bird. That's definitely a play set of totem birds now. Definitely. No question. Alright, so what else do we have? Eh. More generic stuff. Running out of packs. Ooh, Promende Frush, very nice, and Chevalier de Fleur. Alright, we have not seen the Baron or, or the new big boss Speedroid Dragon. And... I probably shouldn't say anything right now because we might jinx ourselves. So we'll just open up these packs and see what we get. Totem bird, nice. And what else do we have? Speedroid. Fuki Mundoshi Piper. Ooh, okay. And Synchro Dilemma. Again. Oh my goodness. Will you go in the pack? Thank you. Alright, we're down to our last two. Alright. What do we have? Totem bird. Alright, and it's coming down to this very last and final pack of this box for the video. Alright, what do we have? Cobat, Speedlift, Zion. Oh, okay, that gives me hope. We got a Necrosynchron. And we've got... 
Oh, it's a trap. Phantom Feathers. Oh, we didn't get the cover. We didn't get him. Oh, my goodness. Uh, oh, well, I, I'll still take the contents of the box. It's been a pretty good pulls. So that will definitely buff my Luristic and Speedroid builds. Very much so. And that might even help uh, like my um, Vehicroid build as well. Because... I do like Vicroids as well. Uh, so... Yeah, I want to get out of... <clears throat> as I was saying. So I want to get out a few other videos. Mostly vlogs. Talking about various topics and such. Along with uh, uh, this other unboxing. Plus also... Obviously for reasons the, um, the Burst of Destiny video as well. Because I haven't got... I've got barely any of that. I think I've got like one pack so far. I need a box. Like I was looking to find this in stock. Alright, so I think we'll leave that there. I hope that you enjoyed watching uh, the unboxing of Synchro Storm. And I'll see you in the next video. So, uh, yeah. That's it for me. Bye.